Christina Marassi, and today is day six of 30 Days of Genius. So I wanted to dive into an interesting topic. We are all looking for our own genius, but what's it like when we see someone else's? And I'll tell you, this was raised for me by Samantha. She left a beautiful comment on my blog, and she was saying that she was having an interesting experience finding her own genius until this wonderful thing happened, where she was with a friend, and her friend was so deep in her own genius that Samantha felt like it was such a visceral experience witnessing her friend and her genius that she felt like it was going to really show her some clues of where to find her own. And I thought this was beautiful. And I think there's something interesting about that because again, we're looking for our own genius, but what's it like when we see everyone else's? Because I keep holding a vision that everyone in the world could be living in their genius and what would that be like? I think it'd be absolutely amazing. So I had my own experience with that today. Um, some of you may know my birthday was on Tuesday and I finally got a chance to celebrate today. And for me, I love to celebrate my birthday with a ritual and to do something a little bit different. And so I have a dear friend, Elaine, who creates these magical ceremonies where people create their own crowns. <laughs> and I thought, that sounds amazing. I'd love to gather an intimate group of friends and have this sacred experience together. So that's what I got to do today. And I'll tell you, the genius was everywhere. <gasps> It was amazing. I got to witness all of my friends make their own crowns, and it was deeply connected to what we are each queen of in our lives and where we are leaders. So it wasn't just let's go do arts and crafts, it was kind of art coming from within. So the genius was afoot, as you can imagine. And what was so great was everyone's crown was so different. So I felt like I got to witness all these beautiful women in their own particular form of genius, and I was so filled up by the experience. So I wanted to share that with you today. So actually below this video, there's a great slideshow that shows the evolution of us making our crowns. And then there's a very fun video because we thought a fun way to celebrate would be to kind of parade around and embody the crowns and kind of really um, dance our way into that. So it's super fun. So I thought you guys might enjoy seeing that. Um, it was very inspirational to me, so I'm hoping you enjoy it. And the invitation is to keep looking for our own genius, but to also keep looking outside for genius and being informed by that. So enjoy the process, and uh, thank you so much for coming along on the Genius Train, and we will talk tomorrow. Take care.